It's been probably the most awful thing in 30 odd years of nursing that I've ever had to go through. Because you are suddenly faced with a disease process that you're not quite sure about. It was this big, huge unknown, how many were gonna be infected or how many lives were gonna be lost. Even people trying to explain what it would be like, looking at videos from other countries, the watching, the waiting for it to arrive. I don't think we ever thought it would be as bad as it was. We started off at nine o'clock one morning with a telephone call being told that I had to make 168 critical care beds. Um, I have at present 24 critical care beds. Initially, you think that somebody's joking and then all of a sudden, no, this is real and I want the numbers by tomorrow. Families can't necessarily see their relatives. Um, so that often makes it more challenging in a way for us to try and describe how they are and what and what they're going through. In critical care we're used to um, the family being there and us being part of the family and explaining things to the family. Um, we couldn't do that, we had to do that through Zoom, um, which my nurses found really, really difficult. Um, families screaming on the other end of a camera um, that they can't see the loved one. And I think balancing that with making sure everybody's all right at home and homeschooling and um, playing football and, and going out for walks and things like that is, is has been um, hard work at times. Lots of us have got family members who we've had to shield as well, so that's been a bit of a worry. I was terrified really. Um, if I caught something or worse, brought it home to my son. My husband didn't say very much, but I know that every time I was leaving the house, he was, what if, what if she come, what if she brings it home? It's probably changed me, and I don't quite know how, and I'm not sure I will know how for, for quite a while. I think it's changed me in a, in a way that um, you, you think you'll remember things through your nursing career, um, but I will always remember this, and I just think, I hope nobody else has to do it again. Yes, things have been challenging. Yes, we've worn PPE. Yes, it's been hot. Yes, it's been difficult. And yes, we know we've faced quite a lot of challenges. But we've still had a social interaction that some people have not. To say I'm proud is probably an understatement. I don't think there is a, a word to express how I feel. I'm just in awe of every single one of them.